Well, hello there. January 30th, Monday, 2023. Faith Pocatello Daily here, going right back into um, the Beatitudes, Matthew 5, verse 4. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Now, it's this interesting thing. Blessed are, happy are you who mourn, for you'll be comforted. Listen, what are we mourning about? Are we mourning about the, the broken state of this world? Are we mourning about selfishness? Um, but the reality is that in Jesus Christ, he provides comfort. Uh, Paul says in 1 Corinthians that we, we are comforted ourselves. Why? Not so that we can consume it upon ourselves, but so we can give comfort to others. So we need to realize that, that we are comforted by the Holy Spirit in a broken world when we face trials and tribulations, when we have tragedy and drama that we are comforted by a, something outside of this world, something that this world cannot offer. We are comforted by God himself. He weeps with those who weep. He rejoices with those who rejoice. So don't think that God is, is, is ignoring you or that God is not sensitive to you. Happy are those who mourn. And this is the mourning over the state of this world, mourning over the state of our loved ones and our neighbors and our and people in our community who, who are apart from Christ that are like, oh Lord, please work on them. Please, Lord, save. Save now I mourn for that. And, and then we realize that because of God's faithful promise, this world is passing away. I, I mourn this world. I mourn these things that are happening in my life. But this is not my home because I am seated in the heavenly places right now, Paul tells us in Ephesians. I'm seated in Christ. And so I'm, I'm, I'm coming from a place of where all the spiritual blessings and the heavenly places has been given and bestowed upon me. And so though I mourn in this life, I look with anticipation for the next life and I find comfort and joy because God is my provider, my defender, my refuge, and my strength. So may God richly bless your day. Enjoy Jesus. Go and share life.